Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's the Oni with Thrifty Divas. I have a Dollar Tree haul for everybody. So I'm gonna try to get this filmed. My husband's getting ready for work, so I'm not gonna be able to do it once he leaves. So let's see if we can just bang this out. So I'm gonna go in no particular order and I'm just going to pull from the bags. So I just picked up one box of these special edition Lucky Charms. This is the regular size box, not the family size. So I went to a store a few days ago and I, and it was a far store, like it was like a special, you know, like it was far. And I realized that I left it there. I left it at the cashier. So I was like, great. So luckily I found them again. Reason being, if you watch me, you've heard me say I bought like the little mini fruity marshmallows and I wanted to do some type of like Lucky Charms bar and my husband ate the box of Lucky Charms that I had. So, um, I'm gonna do it again now. What a production. And, <laughs> and I left the one there, whatever, okay. I picked up a little loaf of whole wheat bread. Uh, we've never had this there at my store, this brand. It looks different, the loaves are smaller, but cool, it looks good. And then I picked up uh, two more bags of the TGI Fridays onion rings. I really, really like them. I do. They're good. I mean, it's no Funyun, but they're good. All right, what else do I have up? Oh, and along those lines, I also found these 25% more TGI Fridays mozzarella sticks. So these are 4.375 ounce bags, and I've had these before, and they're delicious. The onion rings are only 2.75 ounces. These are 4.375. I got a few of the seven days croissants for my son. I picked up two, three packs of the roasted seaweed they are three zero point one seven ounce five grams um, packages i blame my aunt michelle for this the other thrifty divas other thrifty diva every time i talk to her she's complaining about how much seaweed she sits down and eats and she got me wanting some so there we go i picked up some soups for my son i got two of the healthy choice chicken noodle which i know he loves so that one is tried and true but they had this one this kendale farms i got two of these to give this a try chunky chicken noodle and the reason why i got this is because you see it says ready to serve so they did have some Campbell's ones, but they were the condensed one We have to add a can of water and all that stuff. And I was like, I can't, I can't be dealing with that when he wants soup quickly. So these are ready to serve. So I figured I would let him try those. A can of beef ravioli for him. I think that's, oh wait, I have a couple drinks and then I think that'll probably do it on the food unless something sneaks up on us oh that's a lie I'm staring at more food I picked up two of the giant 59 fluid ounce Arizona green tea with honey and ginseng I love these and so does my stepfather so I like to have it for any time that he comes over and for a dollar that 59 ounce is great all right a couple more food items and then we'll move on I picked up one of these Baker's Select chocolate cream cakes. You get five in here. They are individually wrapped. Um, I want, I'm want. i going to assume I could be wrong. Last time they had these, they were a product of Turkey. I used to call them the Turkish Twinkies. But I don't see it here. I don't see it. I don't know. I don't know, but it does say distributed by Greenbrier International this time. I don't think the last ones did. So, picked up one of those. 
And then I grab two of these, these Arizona nacho, nachos and cheese dip. So that's what that looks like. You get your chips there, your nacho cheese there. And it says, um, peel the cover off, place in microwave for 30 seconds, the whole thing. So I figured maybe my husband and I can do like a nice movie night because he always gets that at the movies too. I get the popcorn, he gets that at the movies or the pretzel chunks with the nacho cheese. All right, that's the food. No, it's not. <laughs> just, just one more thing. Um, I always love to have these big Supreme Traditions. This is 3.75 ounce taco seasoning. Love to always keep this in my spice cabinet. A packet of taco seasoning is one ounce, like when they come in packets, like Ortega or whatever. So this is almost four times the amount for a dollar, and I love having this. You can add it to when you're making fajitas or anything, you know, that you want that taco flavor on, shrimp, fish if you're making fish tacos it's chicken it's just really good to have to be able to give anything that taco spice and it's four times the size of a packet so I just wanted to bring that to your attention in case you didn't know so I got him chocolate ones as well the first one I showed was vanilla and I also picked up these Kodak extra life double A's it says tw up to 12, time, 12 times more power. I don't know. You only get two for a dollar, so I'm hoping that they are good. I picked these up to try to put them in my makeup mirror lights. I hope it was two and not four. Dang it. Anyway, all right, so I picked those up because I thought that seemed like a good find. All right, I got this to send to someone. It's a magnet. It says, let's talk about it. I picked this up for my son. <clears throat> I just saw more food. <laughs> this little double barrel water blaster, water squirter. So this is, this doesn't have its own water. You put this in a bucket, suck it up like a syringe and shoot. So I thought that would be fun for him. And here's the other food item. I'm not even going to say, and then that's it, because I don't know anymore, clearly. So I got these Nor pasta sides, cheddar and broccoli, but look at that. I don't recall ever seeing it. I might have, but I know I've seen the rice a million times. But this is fusilli. Fusilli pasta with broccoli and a cheesy cheddar sauce. Little spiral pastas. So I thought those were cool. I picked up two of those. All right, then I got, I got us new glasses that my husband doesn't know about and he's probably gonna kill me. So we have these really tall red plastic ones that we use for like our everyday drinkers, like when we have soda with dinner, like just the two of us or whatever, or when he's working in the yard, stuff like that. And I got them last summer, last spring from Dollar Tree. They're fine, there's nothing wrong with them. I just like to switch things up. So I found these and I really liked these. I think they are a little smaller than what we have now, but I just think they're prettier. So I got four of these, which means that I'll have to throw out the red ones. That's, that's the way that works. But aren't they so pretty? They had a darker blue as well, but I loved this color. So I wanna switch them out. I love them. I lucked out and found more disinfecting wipes. So I grabbed up, grabbed a couple of those. I picked up a pizza pan for a DIY that I wanna do. Uh, no, it's not a tiered tray <laughs> for a different DIY that I wanna do. So I figured I would give it a try and see how that goes. And of course I will show you guys. I picked up one of these pet mats. 
It's a hard plastic pet mat. I just thought it was cute. It's got little paw prints on it. It is distributed by Greenbrier. It's a good size. It's a pretty good size and it's pretty hard. Um, I don't know if I'll use it as a pet mat. I might, but that's why I grabbed it because I'm like, I will find something to do with it. Even if it's my son like playing with Play-Doh or something and he'll even get the, the paw impressions if he plays with Play-Doh on this. So I don't know, but I just thought it was really cute. I am putting a couple, two or three minutes of bonus footage at the end of this video. So you will see things I did not buy or other variations of things I did buy. So make sure to stay tuned at the end of this video. And then I found this. So this is by Genpack. Genpack is a company in Glen Falls, New York. These are 10 and a quarter inch sectioned off plates. You see that? It's got the three sections. You get 15 in here. It says deep dish and cut resistant. So I grabbed two packs of those. They look to be pretty good quality. So I grabbed two of those and then I got the little seven inch rigid plates and you get 20 in here. So I thought that was nice. All right. I grabbed two <clears throat> of these essentials a cabinet shelf because so I at the beginning of quarantine or right before quarantine I don't even remember I started organizing my craft section it's such a tight space I really really in my opinion performed miracles on that but I'm like it's annoying you know like accessibly it's annoying so my husband bought me a piece of furniture and then I ordered another piece of furniture that came. So I am going to, I don't know which piece is going where. I'm sorry, I'm just gonna put my hair up because it's getting humid now. I am, I don't know which piece is going where. So I have to like try that out, which is gonna be a pain because I have to pull everything out and move furniture around. But I'm gonna do an excess food organization because the system I have right now is not working at all. I will show it to you when I do that. And the craft situation could be better. So long story, but that's why I bought these for, um, I'm thinking the food, whatever cabinet the food goes in downstairs, the extra. So we'll see, but I'll show you. I picked up one of these for my son, these Nickelodeon pop outs take along. You get four crayons and 10 stickers. So here is the coloring book. And if I could get this, uh, here are the stickers. And then you get four crayons in the back. And I do show other variations of this in the, in the bonus footage. So I thought this was really cute for going places. I found another puzzle for myself. <laughs> this one is only a hundred piece. So when you're not that invested, but it's better than a 48 piece. So this is by crazy art as well, hundred piece. And it's got the adorable cupcakes on it. So, you know, I had to pick that one up for myself. I found this mug. Do I need it? No. Um, will I find something to do with it? I will. So check this out. It's all dusty. It's this beautiful, big, and it's by Plates and Beyond. Like I always say, they, they're the best stuff by me. Anytime it's cool, it's Plates and Beyond. So it's this beautiful baby pink oversized mug and it's black inside. So pink and black. And I absolutely love that. So I just grabbed one. Just one. What am I? Okay. Then one fell. I got two of these. Anna over at Only In My Dreams. Hey, Anna. Showed these and I was on the hunt for them. At one store, I saw the empty box and I was like, dang it. 
at another store I lucked out and found them so normally this is not a big deal right foam glider they always have it but this is a big deal for me <laughs> so you get the glider and you get stickers to decorate it it is this color it is this color and ever since she showed them I'm like oh my god I have to find that just because I love like dark things and I love black and I love you know can you see that through the package the color of the styrofoam yes so excited so I got two to have a backup because you know he's gonna break this one and they're just so cool so I got that I got ugh, sorry for my reach a couple of little decorative signs I love this one love me love my pet what is the movie leave it down below in the comments because I'm going blank and I'm such a movie buff but I'm going blank the movie with Al Pacino where he's talking to his neighbor across the little wall in the backyard the woman and then one of the last things he says to her when he walks away is or before he walks away is love me love my garden you guys know what I'm talking about somebody leave it down below in the comment I cannot for the life of me remember what movie it is. Anyway, help me. All right, so I got this Love Me, Love My Pet. And the reason why I just brought up that story, that movie, is because that's what this made me think of. Love Me, Love My Garden. So. Love it. Okay. Then I got this. What does it say? It's time to sparkle with the eyelashes and it's got the glitter in there. Now I have heard people say that this leaks out, but this one is not luckily, but I got this for my walk-in closet, which I will also be showing you very, very shortly because it's just about done to perfection, I think. So, love it. And the purple, of course. They did have a few other ones. I put that in the bonus footage. However, I forgot to put the others of this. All right, I totally could have gone two videos on this, but I'll just make it quick. I did decide to pick up one of these Garnier Color Sensation uh, in deep burgundy because I was like, it's such a good deal. I don't want to pass it up. So I actually bought one to give to my mom because there was a time where my mom was doing her hair this color. So I don't know if she, and then she just went to dark brown. So in case she should ever want to go back, I don't know. And I probably should have gotten two in case she ever wants to go back. But I picked up a pack of Raid, hello, Raid Fly Ribbons, a four pack. I bought two of these last summer, two packs. Don't ask me where they are. I don't know. I don't know if my husband knows where they are. But anyway, so I picked up, you used them. Oh, they're all done? The strips? Oh, no. Oh. No. Ever seen these? There's two, I bought two packs last spring. I have no idea where they went. I don't know. Anyway, anyway. Um, so yeah, I got to hang out here. My husband bought this like super expensive like machine that like exudes carbon dioxide to attract bugs and then sucks them into a chamber. It's not working that well. I wanted another pack of these. I'll have to How wait. You know? um, I just saved your life. I see bugs. It's a 55 piece crafter square letters in rainbow. I have a project that I want to do with these. Um, I can at least do one with this. So that's all they had. Then I picked up these and these are Zoo York. These are not for me. So I'm not going to try them on, but they're in the Wayfarer shape, kind of. They got these gorgeous little flowers on it, and I don't know if you'll be able to see that. Probably not. It's written in silver script. It, yeah, no. It says New York right there. Anyway, yeah. 
So I picked those up, not for me. <clears throat> I picked up some of the Max Block After Sun uh, towelettes, the aloe vera wipes, and you get 25 in there, and they are seven by seven inches, and they have the nice little door. I love that. I showed these in a walkthrough, I don't know, last week or something, and then I decided to get it, and I did put my phone in here, and it fits. So it's this nice little phone case, and then it's got this belt clip. I don't know. I catch myself wearing pants with no pockets a lot of times, and I'll admit, like, I have no pockets, like, on my shirt or my pants, like, nothing. So I will stick... And, and it's bad for you, or so they say, but I will stick my phone right here up on my shoulder. But I, that's why I decided to get this, because I was like, oh, then I can like clip this onto my pants and have a place for my phone. Yeah, and my phone fit in there just fine with a case on. I bought one of these last spring, but it is in my giant makeup roll. My makeup roll is like this big. Um, so I got one to keep on my dresser for my daily, not daily, I don't wear makeup daily, but <laughs> not when I'm not working, <clears throat> um, you know, for my easy access stuff. And this is a fan that says slay and I love it. So I do this to dry off your layers, dry off your primer, dry off your setting spray, things of that nature. Um, and if you want to find, and it has the little tassel, if you want to find this in the store, they have different words and it says it right on the tag for you. Okay, I think we're down to the last few things. Yep. What is this? Oh yeah. So I picked these up. They had them in gold also. So they're these little LED tea lights. And I got the silver, the super, super shiny silver glitter, if you can see that. I love them. So I just brought back these two glass beaded wall sconces from my mom's house because she, I still have stuff left there and she's like, come get all your stuff. So I got those to put up in my bedroom here and they do take candles. I'm not even going to like use them, you know, they're just so pretty, but I thought these would go perfectly in there. I don't even know if you'll be able to see it, but if you can that's a nice look because I love glitter. Okay, then I don't like crossword puzzles. I much prefer word searches. However, I could not resist because look at the logo and stuff. Coffee time puzzles. It's got that like old school logo and then the front was shaped like a cup. So it just got me. And then it's got coffee on the back. It's by Bendin. So it is just this little Coffee Time Puzzles crossword book. And speaking of books, I found two really good books, I think. And that will conclude this haul. Yes, it will. All right. So the first one I found was called Cookie Delicious. And it retailed for just $16 in the U.S. Would have thought it was a little higher, but it is hardcover. And it says 50 cookie dough recipes for candies, cakes, and more. Interesting, interesting. I don't know. But yeah. So, hey, sign me up. Sign me up. I picked that up and the very last book. I thought this was absolutely gorgeous. This retailed for $35 US and it is Rosie Dakin Butter Celebrates. And it says delicious recipes for special occasions and it's got this like bronzy like rose gold coppery foil trim on it. It is just such a gorgeous, gorgeous book and the little fairy lights, the macarons, like 
gorgeous. So it just pulled me in. It says from Mother's Day to Christmas to the birth of a new baby, Easter or a picnic in the park, Butter Celebrates is the baking book you will use every day of the year. So I picked that up. Thought that was beautiful. All right, so that is it, guys. That will do it for this haul. Um, my husband and I started on, sorry for reaching, sorry for reaching and everything's gonna fall. My husband and I started on the preparation, the, the priming, so to speak, of the water wall yesterday. Um, and I will be doing it in the next couple days, but my husband is working. So I am home alone with little man, so it does make it challenging, but we shall see. But it is coming, so I'm super excited about it. And so is my son, so I hope it gets done quickly. All right, so thank you guys for hanging out with me today. I hope you enjoyed. Stay tuned for two to three minutes of bonus footage. And until the next video, stay blessed, my friends. Look at these pinwheels. They have the B one, the ladybug one, and like the monarch butterfly looking one. I don't recall ever seeing these. They're so cute. And then they have this Crest 3D White Whitening Therapy. It's only 0 0.85 ounces, but it's with charcoal. That's pretty cool. Then I see these two Crayola Project poster markers. You get two washable markers in a pack, and these are the three color combinations it comes in. Pink and purple, blue and green, and red and white. And then they have these pop-outs. These are the varieties. So we have uh, My Little Pony, Shimmer and Shine, Paw Patrol, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And then we have the uh, Tonka Trucks and the Transformers. So this is what the back looks like with the crayons. And then here are the glitter signs. Unicorns are real, the mermaids told me. Sparkle with all your heart and it's time to sparkle. Then here are um, the pet mats. That's the gray one that I purchased and here it is in white as well. Then I see these stemless wine glasses. I only see Mrs. There's no Mr. or anything like that. Then happy birthday. Then it's my birthday month with the cupcake and these are glass. And then there's this huge gallon size. I think it's a gallon, 64 fluid ounce oxygen power stain remover. If you read the instructions on the back, it says to put it in a spray bottle. And here is another variety of the Garnier Color Sensation. This is in California Sunset. And this is new, this Blue Raspberry Starburst Drink Mix Zero Sugar. Just to remind you, that's the other all pink that they had uh, by Easter. And then I also see a sun-kissed strawberry. And by the register, they have two packs of face masks for a dollar. So that's it for this video in its entirety, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Until the next video, stay blessed, my friends. I love each and every one of you.